There's something weird going on here. How did I get here? Who am I? Who is this Tolero feller and why is she being so sweet to me? And how do I escape? How do I escape the ruins? That's not Hootie McHooterson's voice. Maybe she went downstairs. Hello, lady. You wish to know how to return home, don't you? Oh, do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now be a good child and go upstairs. No, wait! I have to leave. You can't do this to me. You can't force someone to love you. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come. They leave. They die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I'm only protecting you. Do you understand? Go to your room. I refuse to go to my room, young lady. I'm leaving. Do not try to stop me. This is your final warning. But I have to go. You, you have to let go what you love. You want to leave so badly? Hmm. You are just like the others. There is only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. I was expecting like her to turn around and she had like a scary face. Ah, Tolerel, check. Attack 80, defense 80, holy crap. Knows best for you, gotcha. Holy mother of sweet pumpkin pie. This song's pretty good. You couldn't think of any conversation topics. Gosh dang it. Ah, Toro looks through you. Talk. You try to think of something to say again, but... Eh, nothing happened. Oh my gosh, this this fight's gonna kill me. I think I have... I have pie if I need it. SPR Donuts. Yes, you ate the spider donut. Your health is max. I should have saved that for later. What am I thinking? Oh my gosh, this is such a bullet hell. <laughs> oh, but I love it still, because you can still dodge it. It's unlike other RPGs where you can't dodge anything, yet literally, ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Whoop, aha, I dodged, ah, uh, crap. I forgot that they just don't fall down. Let's talk, come on. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to the situation. But I don't want to hurt you. Ah, uh, crap. Ah, oh, jeez Louise. She takes a deep breath. Mercy? I can't mercy her yet. I can't mercy her yet. Ironically, yeah. I'm gonna die. I should heal. Mystery candy? Monster candy. Okay, you recover 10 HP. Great. Oh my gosh. It's like trying to trying to dodge stuff in the Binding of Isaac. It's like that. Repairs a magical attack. I can't fight you, Toro. I love you too much. I just want to talk. I can do this. I can I can leave this area. What if you go back to your room? I wonder what happens then. I guess I can't talk to her anymore. I'm trying to be I'm trying to be like, okay, time to dodge. I want to spare. I don't want to hurt you. <laughs> I really don't. I, you probably have to hurt her. Mercy spare. She doesn't give two craps. Ow. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna totally die in this fight. Toro takes a deep breath. Mercy? Spare. Can't you tell I don't want to hurt you? I don't want to hurt any of the monsters in here. They're too adorable. Uh, does the bandage help me? You reapplied the bandage, you recovered 10 HP. Great. I kind of wish it was like South Park Stick of Truth and that you could use an item before you do anything else. Toro is acting aloft. Spare. Hey, I gotten this far by sparing most of the monsters. I I probably can make it through the rest of the game. Okay, let me try to talk to you now. Ironically, yeah, okay, great. Maybe if I keep trying to spare her, she'll eventually be like, okay, I can't hurt you no more. Maybe. Or maybe I'm just wasting my time. Oh, she seemed to react to that one. Ooh. ooh. Gosh dang it, <laughs> I'm gonna die. Spare. What are you doing? <laughs> I'm trying to spare you! Ah... Uh, kind of like a dodging system, but I still suck at it. Looks through you. Okay, I need the pie. Great. No, it's butterscotch cinnamon pie. Get it right, guys. Come on. I don't know if one guy made this. If one guy made this, I'm gonna... I'm, I'm, I just want to applaud. Okay, let me... 
Attack or run away. I'm not running away. I will spare you. I'm not evil. I just wish to hug. Can you, like, throw the toy knife at her? <laughs> that sounds mean. What are you proving this way? That I can win with the power of love. I can win with the power of love. Bring it. Fight me or leave. I do not wish to leave. I wish to hug it out. What if I'm just wasting time? Oh, her attacks. I think they're... Stop it. I think her attacks are getting, like... Like, slower or weaker or something. Or I'm just seeing things. Stop looking at me that way. Give me a hug. You lamb mother, you. I kind of don't want to do the mercy the other way, the fighting way, because that sounds mean. Go away! No, I love you, but you have to let what you love go. You have to let it go. Talk. Ironically, yes, I just have to keep sparing her at this rate. I got you. I got you, Tolarel. Mercy. Don't do this to me. I don't even know what those are. Those are hoofs. Spare you. I guess she'll eventually... Oh, she's completely missing me now. Something's working. I know you want to go home, but... Please go upstairs now. Can we hug? I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we don't have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. No. Ha ha ha. <laughs> ha 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 ha. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here, yes. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be the right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. Thank you. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. Oh, Just make me cry, why don't you? <laughs> I love you. Goodbye, my child. Goodbye, Tolrel. I love you. I just became emotionally attached to a, a creature who I probably won't see again. <laughs> Animations remind me of Earthbound too. Anyway, back on the Earthbound subject, wow. You get me emotional, why don't you? This is a long freaking haul. I guess it's the like, obviously a good gameplay dynamic. It's like, huh, this long hallway. I can think about what just happened. No music, no nothing. It's just like, oh gosh, the flower. Clever, very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it kills or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spare the life of a single person. Hee <laughs> I bet you feel really great. I do. You didn't kill anyone this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you're tired of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I'm the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't re regicide. This is so much more interesting. What the? Oh my gosh, that's scary. But you're still pretty cute. I hug it. Well, that's great to know that there's a creepy little flower in this game. And out of the ruins, under... Well, that was a great game, guys. Um, I'm glad I played it. Short, to the point. If that's really it, I'm gonna be like, what the freak did I just play? That was the opening. <laughs> I swear there's one game that does that, where it's like... Where it's like, hey, welcome to this game. There's a camera <laughs> hidden in the bushes. Okay. That's interesting. I guess we're outside now. We're either outside in the ruins, or uh, we're in the... That tree almost scared the crap out of me, but... Hey, a stick! It's a tough-looking branch. It's very heavy to pick up. Can I pick it up later? And you... 
Oh, snap. Oh, snap, crackle, pop. Let's get out of here. Rice Krispie treats. Man, I have, like, no health. I guess that's an item. Yeah, you equip... <laughs> that noise it just made when I equipped it sounded like Earth... I'm just gonna make Earthbound references at this rate. You know, I'm not, I'm not good at scary games, and I'm not sure that this is just a, an interesting game at this rate. At this rate, I'm just making crap up. Just make me sound like I... Oh, no. Oh, hello, Mr. Shadow Friend. Don't be racist, don't be racist. <laughs> whoa, 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 calm down. You men. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Yeah, man, how are you? Turn around and shake my hand. Okay. Uh, it's... What the freak? <laughs> the old whoopee cushion and the hand trick. It's always funny. You got that right. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans. Sans the skeleton. Nice to meet you. I'm actually supposed to be on the watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother... I don't know what the... I don't know. He's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through it. My bro made this bar. It's too wide to stop anybody. Hey, hey, we made it. You're pretty nice, Sans. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. <laughs> Looks just like me. Convenient. Sup, bro? You know what, sup, brother? It's been, f it's been eight days and you still haven't recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp? It's really cool. Don't you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the great Pear Paparis, will, will get all the things I utterly desire. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I'll be your friend, buddy. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. You want a kiss? Mwah. There you go. Maybe this lamp will help you. What are you trying to do, Sans? Sans, you're not helping me, you lazy bones. All you do is sit and boondoggle. You get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. Ask Skeleton. Get the heck out of here. <laughs> Sans. Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. <laughs> Sigh. Why does why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get so, some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself down to the bone. This guy, he's killing me. <laughs> I will tend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. He he he. Ah, it didn't work. He didn't have the ch ch you know, that thing. Hey. He. Oh, he laughed. Okay, you can come out now. You try to like, you try to, I know what you try to do. You're trying to get him to get me. I, I saw that. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of his hilarious jokes. My, my hilarious jokes, whatever. What's this little thing? Some sort of checkpoint of, or sentry station. There's some bottles of ketchup, mustard, and relish sitting inside. It's a hot dog stand? Okay. Actually, hey. Hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Don't start with the sappy music, it's making me sad again. 